Um, this next poem is called Love is Freedom. Who likes their freedom? I did. I always have. Uh, this is my way of empathizing with some of these kids that we're mentoring. They have less than us. They're frustrated. And we all had our frustration as a kid, and this was one of mine. Uh, I wasn't good in school. They couldn't shut me up. I, uh, I moved around all the time, I couldn't stay still, and uh, luckily I found art, I found the stage. But um, this kind of poem shed some light on that frustration I felt. Uh, these next two poems actually, and, and this one in particular, Love is Freedom. <sighs> Kids are free, and so are we. We bind them down, we plead and say, please, sit here, do this, not too loud, don't make me shout. Paralyzed in their mental jail cells, they have to obey, slowly losing that idea of play. Sit here for hours, if you fool around, there'll be no playground. Frowns from that sound bringing them down until they come back around. Realizing the vicious cycle casting shadows of compassion knowing that those teachers and parents are just doing the same thing that was done to them. It's all they know. Well, now I know that I can be a rebel, ripping off the medals that boosted my ego, practicing my free throws. What's important is what she knows. The gentle and precious feminine kindness that feels warm, created. Now these distant memories faded of being locked up in classrooms, sent to my room for playing outside in the middle of June? Nothing's gonna happen to me. Your paranoid fear is crippling my knees. I'm falling. But now I'm calling back to my inner child so that I can be wild and energy not mild. It's bold. It has no boundaries. 25 years old and look, mom, I found me. Again, wow, so long it's been since they locked me up in my playpen. Wow. All right, all right, that was a fun one. Uh, I love getting angry at my childhood. Wow. Um, awesome.